So it is uh, 10 past five on Friday uh, and a start in two hours, um, which is scary. My overriding thought right now is why did no one, why did no one try and talk me out of this? <laughs> I'm just packing some thermals. It's going to be a really cold night, um, some extra clothes, my toothbrush. I don't know if I'm going to get a chance to clean my teeth even. Um, and yeah, getting ready to leave. It's so daunting. It is so daunting. Really, really lovely today to, to be featured on K1 Radio, who have been amazing supporters of this. Uh, my family over there. Um, the news have been on the phone and it's all going well. There's lots of press and hopefully more will be coming over the next few days. But yeah, let's um, game face. So it has begun officially venue number one, the incredible Guildhall, um, stood on an empty stage in an empty room, but not a completely empty room um, because we've had two incredible helpers come down, Kelly and Matt are down here in the darkness somewhere. And we're gonna get some professional footage rather than me walking around with my phone um, doing this. So at least one part of whatever we use this for is gonna look stunningly gorgeous um, and not least because I'm in it. Hospital tree, fairy light tied away and washed over me. It's been stuck in a cupboard all year. I'm desperately glad that it's here. And um, yeah, incredible venue. We're here at the Corn Exchange. So we are here, we've done um, three now. We've just done, done the rusty crab. Um, carefully back, guys, there's a clock all around, just in case it's icy. Um, and we are here just in front of Customs House, which is lit up blue, all for me. Only it's not, that's a lie, it's just coincidence. Um, Glenn and Phoebe are over here. Say hi, guys. They've been amazing. Um, they'll be leaving me soon because it's getting colder and they're whimpering out. Um, but yeah, we're now off to the Rascala to do one there. We've got lots of footage, lots of donations, and everything's going swimmingly. Big up to the guys from the 856 Foundation who are keeping me warm with this lovely scarf and this lovely hat. Um, I think I need two of them though because it is getting bitter. So this is gig number four, five, five. I think losing track already. Of Kelly and 24 gigs in 24 hours. So I'm still wide-eyed, bushy-tailed, and it's all looking good for now. So enjoy this one because if any of you see me tomorrow, We've just done gig number five. Um, it's all going swimmingly well so far. Um, life is good. Life is good. I'm not feeling too tired. I'm not feeling too cold. Thanks to the guys at 856 who have hooked me up with scarves and hats and stuff. So that's good. Um, I'm now going to wing my way towards Norfolk Street. Uh, we can do some more gigs that way. Um, and yeah, try and keep warm. Get a volunteer with the SOS bus. Chat to those guys. See a little bit about what they do. Um, and just have a wonderful time. It's 
uh, this place is a jungle. Um, just walking back to the SOS bus, we've just been with uh, a young guy who has had one too many sherbets for the last hour. Um, gonna play a song and then, yeah, um, entertain some lovely police officers we just met. So I'll try and take some videos as we go. The work that these guys do is absolutely incredible. I've just seen it firsthand, um, helping a young lad out, making sure he got home safe. Um, he had one too many sherbets, let's put it that way. And um, yeah, it's, it's great. So if anybody needs this bus, it's just outside QD. Um, you guys have offered loads of help and support. And it's not just condoms and flip-flops. That's what I've learned tonight. So it's all good. Come and, um, come and see them if you need them. I am really cold. Oh, I'm sorry for this. Um, yeah. Wow. Uh, really, really enlightening time with the the guys on the SOS bus. Um, yeah. Left them with a song, which is great. Um, so now I, I've got a bit of a. I played them a song and then ran. <laughs> That's what I've done. Back in the van. Uh, yeah. It, it's on to motivate now. It's like 10 to 4 in the morning um, and I'm having coffee number three. I'm very, very tired. So I am in a gym. I don't often frequent these kind of places. Looks all about high tech. Um, and I'm literally the only person here. So. I'm gonna get my guitar out. I'm gonna prop my phone up somewhere. And let's um, let's have a sing song in an empty gym because that's just what's gonna happen because it's 4 a.m. in the morning. There's someone here. There's actually someone here, um, which is amazing. So this is one of the ones that I said would be a gig to no one. It's gonna be a gig to to one person. Um, who probably wants like workout music and not this, but yeah. I'm at gig number 11. Now, in Tesco, um, for the start. <clears throat> My voice is starting to go, that's not ideal, I'm not even halfway through yet. Um, so I'm gonna have a can of coke rather than a coffee. I'm gonna have a coffee in there. We have a can of coke now, and some throat spray. Um, quickly look at the words to some Christmas songs because I knew them earlier and I don't know. I'm in the uh, canteen at Tesco and there was a bit of confusion because I got told that they all went on break at five and they all finished break at quarter to five. But the shop opens at quarter to six, so I will be in the lobby. Um, yeah. I'm in McDonald's. And for once, it's not to eat McMuffins, but it is to have coffee number five. Um, I've just played a song and yeah, happy days. Um, KL1 Radio is next. <laughs> <laughs>